Yeah, it was really, really good. Um, I enjoyed it. It's nice and different, and you don't often see it every day, and especially for free as well. Well, well worth, well worth the watch. Mm, I think that it was quite surprising, to be honest, because you know you don't, I didn't expect this. And for me, it was absolutely beautiful the scene when they meet each other with the music, then they dance together, they share looks. It was absolutely brilliant. I thought it was fantastic. Um, really incredible um, to see. The, the clothes were astonishing, the style, the elegance, the way they were uh, um, flamboyantly taking control of the space and uh, celebrating. Uh, the style and me and my son, uh, my five-year-old, couldn't wait for him to open the box. We didn't know what was going to be inside the box and we were desperate to know what was inside the box. And then uh, when it was the shoes and they got put on and he started dancing, that was, f that was fantastic. It was quite spectacular and colourful and exciting and you could just see like the audience's faces, especially the children, they were just wowed. Um, so I was here in more of a supervisory role as a member of staff. Um, so, but it was really great to see our audiences responding so positively to the performance. Really exciting. And it was so kind of, um, I don't know, just really a lot of movement. It was really vibrant. Um, everyone was like, wow, and gasping to see the movement. So that was my favorite part, yeah. I thought it was very inspirational as I am a dancer myself. Go watch it. Um, it's very ins inspirational if you're an aspiring dancer or if you just like to be entertained go and see it. I thought it was absolutely wonderful um, I thought Patrick's choreography was just beautiful and the dancing overall was really really special. Um, I think the massive highlight for me was the audience um, reaction to it particularly some of the younger audience uh, who clearly were absolutely enthralled by it and just really excited by the fact that they stumbled upon this in the Bridges Shopping Centre. <laughs> Uh, I would say that if they wanted to see a really beautiful piece of choreography um, which really told a fantastic story but was also really colourful and fun and exciting then definitely come and see Dandyism. I really enjoyed it. It, it was something very very different for Sunderland so it was uh, great seeing it. Something like you're not used to seeing. It's like it's not sort of contemporary dance, it's not like um, typical kind of thing and it's just something I think you have to see for yourself but then when it all came together and that everyone was interacting with one another, it was brilliant. I really enjoyed it, I thought it was really good. Yeah. Good. Oh, definitely coming to see the performances and the outfits are amazing. Yeah. Really good, good fun, good for kids as well, I think. Oh, that was fabulous. Yeah. They are so fantastic to, to look at. Those costumes are amazing. <laughs> so, and the, the entrance down the stairs was really quite spectacular. Um, and the singing, I didn't know there was going to be any singing involved in it. Um, I loved the dancing. The children were absolutely fascinated, enthralled with it. So, um, I would say this is a really interesting, original piece of dance um, that highlights something that we know very little about in this country. Dandyism in Africa apparently is massive. I didn't know anything about it. Uh, I feel I, I want to know more now.